Oh, got it again. The play and wide, wide, wide open is Des Bryant. Touchdown. And the Giants just look around. Roll looks back at Webster as if to say, what happened? And when he picks up this crossing route, Webster thinks that he's just in a zone and Roll is barbecue. This is professional football, and we have seen some very... Lots of time for Roethlisberger. The check down to Bell, almost always a good option. Does he go out of bounds? He's in bounds. He is in bounds. Bounce. Off the fake to Rodgers. Winston sets. Wide open is the tight end. O.J. Howard, and he will take it. Cowboys come. Blitz is on. And free is Manningham. And he will walk into the end zone to give the Giants the lead. A flat called on Cruz, but the touchdown counts, and the Giants have the lead again. Just a completely blown coverage. Barry Church comes down, but he was the second guy on a two-receiver side. Nobody else on that side of the field, and then you'll see the late hit at the end of the sand. There's just there's no way down the field, and then you're going to get a hustle attempt guy in the end. Kaepernick. And going deep, wide open, and making the catch is Torrey Smith. And Smith racing for the end zone. Touchdown. And Foles able to get away and throw. Pass is caught. Jeffrey, touchdown. Blackwell stepping up and throwing deep down the far sideline. Caught into the end zone. Touchdown, Jacoby Jones. Second down, and four at the 31. Chris Johnson now lines up, and look, nobody's covering him. Nobody's covering Chris Johnson. Wow! There he goes again. Breakaway speed, and he'll jog into the end zone. Touchdown! Gus, the Texans shoot themselves in the foot again. There's 70,000 people in this stadium, all but 11 of them saw Chris Johnson standing by himself. He just walked out of the huddle and jogged out to his spot. Great recognition by Kerry Collins. Yeah, I'll tell you what, to see him, that's a, that's a veteran quarter. Wilson with time, throws wide open. Touchdown, Tyler Lockett. Second down and seven. Brings over the middle. Wide right open is Cole Stutter. He will take it all the way for the Saints' third touchdown. Keeps the play alive. Directs and fires to Johnson, who's free. And Megatron's all the way home. Touchdown, Detroit. Here. Here comes the collision with the two Giants, but that collision may not have mattered. Rodgers from Hardy had lost Johnson. Brady still has it across the middle, wide open. He's got Hogan and an open field, untouched. And a handoff, fake, and there's Stafford looking for a target, and wide open in the end zone to make the touchdown is Titus Young, no defender near him. Well, you know about secondary play, so you know about mix-ups back there, John. Uh, just a miscommunication. I do know it can't happen. That will kill a defense bigger than anything else, and that's just too easy for Matthew Stafford, Titus Young. Miscommunication on, be on behalf of the Denver Broncos. Matt Ryan likes the coverage. Wide open! That's going to be a touchdown Atlanta running away. You call pre-snap, and it looked like confusion in the Vikings secondary. Absolutely. The Vikings showing some blitz here, so you know these two guys are in man-to-man -man coverage. You see them give the signal. They're going to bracket that. One guy had to take Roddy White there. They missed him. Wide open is A.J. Green for the touchdown. How in the Los Saints from their own 25. Reeves. Right now, still wide open is Goodbye, touchdown.
first and goal from the one. Rodgers looking end zone. Now he throws across the field, wide open for the touchdown. Pass last week. It's Bilal Powell on first down. Powell getting across the 30. They say he wasn't down. Powell still going. Nobody touched him. Powell through the end zone. He's a catch here, too. <laughs> Correct. But they need a little bit more to return that. Macklin is wide open. Touchdown, Philadelphia. A 68-yard score. That's Chip Kelly's offense. Even though it's the first play of the drive, they come out and they catch Jacksonville in a blown coverage. And because of all the different personnel and all the formations, somebody drops Macklin and forgets all about him. And all Foles has to do is throw it out. Yeah, we talked about the effect of that run game with LaShawn McCoy, Darren Sproles, the play action. Over the top, wide open, Dwayne Allen. And Luck has thrown four touchdowns here tonight. The whole stadium was looking at Ahmad Bradshaw. He came off the field laughing with his helmet off. That whole New York Giant defense says there's no way we're going to let Bradshaw sh score. And they fake the ball to him, and no one covers Dwayne Allen. Outstanding design. Peyton still has the football. Can you believe it? Peyton Manning runs it in for the touchdown. Four wide receivers and the running back in the game. Manning throwing over the middle. Nice catch at the 30-yard line by Harrison. Harrison doesn't feel he's been touched on his way to the end zone. Touchdown. What a mental game. That is by the Bronco defense. The Broncos are going to argue about who has who on this pass. Marvin Harrison catches it. Is he touched? No, he is not. You can see the Broncos are all talking to each other. Very alert. If you don't hear the whistle, keep playing. They sent on fourth downs last year. Scrolls up the middle. First down and more. Darren Scrolls off to the races. Can he get there? Yes, touchdown, Philadelphia. That was all tempo by Chip Kelly. He called it right after they missed on the third and short. He said, snap, quick snap it. And the Jacksonville Jaguars were very late getting set. They were fatigued. They'd had enough. They were lazy getting up to the lazy, ball. They were lazy, and doubt. that's what did. They ran it right up the middle of the formation. Red Bryant told us. Gus Bradley told us. They're not, you can see them moving around. They're not set. They're not ready. They might have been a step out of position. I said, let's try to get Darren Sproles more involved in the second half. He's been at four. They don't have to bring extra people. Far lets it go. Downfield. Pass caught. Touchdown. Go 47 yards to Sidney Rice. What a year it's been for number. Good for 47 <laughs> yards down the sideline, and he was actually well covered, but a perfect throw from Brett Favre. The Cowboys are in cover, too. Gerald sends the ball. He gets caught trying to disguise coverage. He's up closer to the line of scrimmage, even than corner Terrence Newman. Newman, I'm not sure what he was doing because he doesn't get it jammed on Rice whatsoever, and then it's just one-on-one, -on -one, a foot race, and a perfect throw by Brett Favre. Good catch there by Sidney Rice. Favre takes some punishment at the end of the play. They want to limit the hits. It's tight end in the NFL. He thinks his upside's unlimited. Open gap, heading for the end zone, and stepping in is Cedric Benson, and the Bengals are an extra point away from tying the game. And Cedric Benson has now run nine times for 64 yards. Look how easy that was.